A stream runs through Gaithersburg. It's part of the long draft branch east of Seneca Creek State Park. To many neighbors, these five acres provide a calming refuge. Forests make a difference about how cool it is on a hot summer day. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. It's a significant. Uh, urban tree canopy is an essential component of our healthy urban living. My blood pressure goes down, my heart relaxes, my, my, my troubles go away. But the city of Gaithersburg sees this stream as a potential danger. Its banks cutting too deep over time, possibly exposing sewer pipes and potentially eroding people's backyards while causing flooding. So it wants to turn this stream into something like this. The past project Gaithersburg did at nearby Bloom Park. This isn't unique to Gaithersburg. Stream restoration projects can also be found in Alexandria, Virginia. These re-engineered meandering streams deposit less sediment after heavy storms. We're not just tr trying to check a box here. Uh, we're trying to take the opportunity with these programs to do sort of the greatest good. Beyond the trees, neighbors are concerned for the wildlife living in these woods. And the city says, oh, they'll just leave and come back. But if you think about it, you've got six months of heavy equipment. Neighbors propose the city focus on reducing stormwater surging through these acres by tackling urban runoff upstream versus cutting the trees. Things like installing stormwater retention ponds and better maintenance or stormwater drains. We have uh, essentially um, a non-functioning or poorly functioning uh, ecology in the area. This is a shag bark hickory tree. Given its trunk diameter and how slow it grows, this tree could be 230 years old, according to a recent city inventory. George Washington was president then, and even if it doesn't end up on the list of trees chosen by the city to be cut down, nearly every tree around it could be. In Gaithersburg, Nathan Baca, WUSA 9.